Hey, it's Matt with St. Bonaventure University, Cyber 501. This week's lab 6.2. We are going to be doing what we did in lab 6.1, uh, Wi-Fi hacking. Uh, this time, instead of aircraft, we're going to be using Wi-Fi 8. So, um, I uh, have um, recorded screencast from my Kali laptop, which I used for this. And so I'll do the play-by-play -play of uh, what I did there. So, we first start out a hacking against uh, web using Wi-Fi-web on my Linksys. And you see, we go right into it. And it's getting some IVs. It takes a few seconds. Um, I generated some traffic by connecting with my uh, my iPad, playing some YouTube video, and we hit ten thousand IVs. It starts cracking. And there it is. It's done. It saved results to crack.txt, which um, weren't in documents. They in this other root folder accidentally realized my mistake there's crack.txt <coughs> and we can see the hex key right there 1d30 1d15 5f so let's try it with WPA and um, so we're gonna run this now with the dash WPA found it control C um, actually found my other uh, router as well. Um, so I hit two. Now, skipping the uh, PMK ID attack because we didn't have those tools installed. So it says it's going to take eight minutes here for a second. So um, let's see what happens. Maybe not. Found some clients doing some deauths. Um, and decided to, uh, at this point, uh, generate a little more traffic, and I uh, logged in with my iPhone as well at some point here. Yep, two clients, and oh, captured a handshake. And... Decided to run a uh, aircrack NG, and um, I'm going to pause real quick, go back there, just show you it, it, it actually um, captured the password of password from the um, password files. So now we're going with the uh, WPA2. Uh, interestingly, it still says just uh, WPA on the encryption, but it is running WPA2. Uh, pretty much the same thing as the previous. Discovering any clients in this name. <clears throat> Looks like it's uh, doing some DOS. Now I changed the password on this too when I changed it to WPA2. And it's going to do the same thing. Save the cap file. Doing analysis of the handshake file. And it's cracking and it cracked it and we'll pause real quick and you can see there's the, the password QWERTY UIO. So that was really quick. <coughs> Excuse me. Um, so there it is, Wi-Fi uh, wi 2 um, and cracking against this guy, my Linksys router and you can see here, oh I'm not logged in. There are WPA2 personal with AES encryption QWERTY UIO. Yeah, that's uh, Wi-Fi um, hacking my <laughs> web WPA and WPA2 um, uh, security of, with ease pretty quickly. Uh, definitely, uh, if you're going to use WPA2, which is the most secure, probably also want to use a, a better password than uh, something that might be in the, uh, the common passwords list. All right, that's it. And... Uh, 
get prepared for lab 6.3 coming up soon.